Well, the thing is, is, is I feel like with you and you and me, a really solid project can rewire our brains so that almost like death and life re rewired my brain so that I could get the fractals. Now fractals has rewired my brain so I can get to something else and then something exactly. else. Exactly. And, uh, it's so cool. If you're going by a formula and you're doing it with this fear that your investors are going to be angry, you're not going to have that experience, that that rewiring. That and and it sounds scary, rewiring a brain, but it is. Scary. It, it was it was wonderful. So from <laughs> 2016 through now, it has been a great not being yeah. able to predict what I'm doing. Yeah. And I'm just doing it and. Like I was telling this guy who was on the podcast, I shot his podcast yesterday. By this point, it's not out, but I'm developing the monster movie. I'm developing a potentially other film that might be shot in January or February, depending on whether it happens. It's supposed to happen in Virginia. I'm doing this graphic novel that is over a thousand pages long. Cool. I'm doing a novella. I'm doing verse. Uh, and plus, of course, these discussions on the podcasts which are partially creative um and it's just oh and then there's another graphic novel and there's all these things that are going on simultaneously i have no idea how any of it's going to go i'm just living it See, and this is inspiring for me because that's exactly the direction that i feel like i'm being led is that i'm going to continue to compose that's for certain and i'm going to get a little bit back into my disciplined sort of practicing because I do feel like my my playing has gone down the last few years not being out playing as much as I was and it's sort of a good time for me to dig in and take that to the next level to some some technical sides of the of my craft that I'd like to focus on and I have the opportunity to focus on now but then I'm finally ready to get my art out there and start selling my art and I've been blogging more and I want to continue to blog more, but it's been interesting. And I'm writing for um, another forum, piano group forum. But what I'm finding is that I really enjoy writing and I really enjoy writing about the stuff that we're talking about today. And so I want to go more that direction too. And it's just time. It's like, I don't need to be, you know, for a long time in New York, I was trying to be that musician, that professional musician. I was doing all the calling card things so that you could you know, be called a jazz musician or called this type of musician or whatever it is. And I'm just not interested in them more. Now I want to just be who I am. And there last week there was a guy that I met that went back and read my blog about something and just really connected, wrote me an email, talked about like he was teary eyed about it. And that's what it's about for me. It can, it's okay if it's just one-to-one -one connections with people or whatever it is. It's, it's perfectly fine. I'm, I'm not going to control what happens with what I put out there, yeah. but I'm going to, what I can control is to have the bravery and the discipline to put it out there. Well, so I met, I I met you. you when you were like a jazz musician, but I feel like now you're your own genre. You're like, right. there's David Lynch is Lynchian. Yeah. And he's his own genre, and you're yeah. Lyndall Descant, your own genre. Yeah, well, I appreciate that, because that's always what I wanted. But you can get lost a little bit, and I think that the val getting validation is like a drug. You yeah. can really oh. spend a lot of time trying to get that. Absolutely. But in the end, I personally could never actually fit entirely in, in any of that. I just couldn't even do it, even if I wanted to. And the other side of it is, if I'm being honest, this, that's what I wanted. And it almost sounds like arrogant to try to want to be your own genre, but it's not arrogant if you consider that everybody could be their own genre. Yeah. And that is interesting to me. I want you everybody know? to be their own genre. Why not? Yeah. Maybe in that way, we all, rising tides raises all boats, yeah. you know, and that's the way to get to a place where we're living in a healthier world.